Suppose you have your OOPS examination on Java in 5 minutes and you don't have JDK or GRE installed. So what do you do? You use a cloud ID, plus there are tons of other benefits of cloud IDs like code collaboration and portability. So today I'm going to show you my six favorite picks. The first one is Code Sandbox. This will satisfy all your JavaScript cravings, all of them. Make static sites, React, View, Gatsby, or just a node application. It has very clean interface with browser and a debugger baked into the editor. You have code collaboration and you can deploy directly to Netflix. Now for the second one, we have something minimal. It's a REPL and it's great for simple projects or testing something. So the OOPS examination I was talking about, I used REPL for it. So after you sign in, you get onto this page and then you just click on the new REPL button, then choose a language. The selection is wide, including the language BrainFuck, which is easiest language to learn. Not kidding. There are not many options. Just write code, execute, plus you can share your REPL. That's it. Now the next one is an all-rounder, a beast, and my personal favorite. It's Gorm IDE. It has a lot of features like code collaboration, deployment, and even GPU support. It basically gives you a container with open to loaded. After you log in, press create container. Choose a stack to start with. Then just wait a little. You have a VS code like editor and a terminal. And now you can hack Pentagon by writing HTML. Just kidding. <laughs> Next, I'm going to tell you about two more platforms. These are not technically IDEs. And it's very likely that you already know about them. CodePen for front-end developers who want to quickly prototype their project or find some inspiration. And next is Google Colab. It's an online Jupyter notebook, very useful for testing and prototyping Python code. And my last pick is Gitpod. It's great for working on GitHub repo without a hitch. It forks the repo and sets up the environment for you automatically. The easiest way to use Gitpod is to install the Gitpod extension then go to a repo page, you will see Gitpod icon there. Click on it and wait for an eternity. So the editor is basically VS Code on cloud. You even have access to all the extensions in the VS Code. And that's it for today guys. Thank you for watching.